Welcome back to another part of the Fielding Crossing. Now we will enter World 4 1. Another new Super Mario Brothers style scene. And some Yoshi's Island music, as I see. As I can hear. Okay. Really high in the sky, even though. We clearly appear to be on land when we're in the overworld. Hmm. Somewhere Mario must have shot up really high to find this. Okay, so it's a red level. I'm going to suspect that the secret exit is in one of these pipes. Any one of these thousands of thousands of pipes. <laughs> Possibly making it millions. Of course, with all these pipes, there might also come a lot of fire. So, best to stay powered up when we can. And best to stay at the top when we can. Let's not allow ourselves to fall into the pit. Still, we will check these pipes. And did that platform appear and disappear out of nowhere? Hmm. Kinda looks like it did. I don't know if the ceiling continues here. Something about this. Something doesn't feel right. Well, none of these pipes. Maybe I missed it. Or maybe it's just gonna be up ahead. Well, let's bring two feathers with us. And Goomba. Is this gonna be a pipe? Nope, it's not a super secret pipe. Well, what about this one? Nope. Eh, checking everywhere I can. Oh, I see. It's a keyhole. But where's the key gonna be? Ha, Chuck, you cannot jump that high. And where is the key? Is it back over by the keyhole? I don't know. Maybe it's really far ahead. Okay. Yes, I might have flown over the level, but I... Okay, the key's right there, I see. Good. Maybe the gimmick involved killing enough uh, Venus Piranha plants? I'm not sure. World 4-3 down there. Let's go back in this. Yeah, really. I, don't, I really don't know how the key is appearing. Well, let's pick up another card. <laughs> Jam the music for even longer now. Get it stuck somewhere. Okay. But anyway, level beaten. So let's fall back down to the ground and unlock World 4-2. In we go. Once again, we're really high up. And I thought that land was filled in. Yeah, yeah, again, maybe it is, but again, we're just really high. Somehow, we're really high. I don't know how that's possible in a place like this. Huh, you can swat those out with your cape. Makes it a bit easier to avoid them. Okay, what kind of rope pattern is that? That's a pretty odd one. Hmm. Looks like a wave, though. Somewhat like a wave. But let's not fall! Let's not get caught by a wave down below. We wouldn't even be able to get up any back up anyway, because we look to be so high. Hmm. You can swat out those enemies with your cape, but you cannot swat out their flames, I see. Well, let's just try to avoid them then. Forget if you can spin jump off of them. I get you can't. Uh, okay. Let's get another power up from here. Ah, oh, great. The return of the Hammer Brother. Hmm. Okay, go away. Hmm. Need to hit it when it's at the very left. Like that. Good. And something down this pipe, I see. Halfway point, okay. It's convenient. And that's gonna send me back here. Good. Now, it's gonna be here. A fire flower. Guess you can't shoot those out with flames. You can't fight fire with fire here. Do it with the piranha plants, but not with those. Hmm. The flames must be like stomach acid to those piranha plants. 
They have no problem spewing them out, but if they get hit with one, they're gonna get... the equivalent of this. And speaking of this, Mario may have to suffer through an eternity of this. Because the halfway point that I got in this level, apparently where it respawns me, it just leads me to a bottomless pit. Somewhere that I cannot safely recover from. Well, let's just keep going. And needless to say... <laughs> had to do a little bit of backtracking and save stating just to get back here. Well, at least we're through this now. I hope we don't have to put up with that again. <sighs> Problematic halfway point. And all of a sudden, apparently World 4-2 makes the ladder appear. So we got another route to Lakitu's castle now. Let's go into World 3... 4-3, sorry. Hmm. Apparently, we're above the water this time. Follow the lines. Don't fall off. If you do, you will lose a Mario. Signed, one down. Well, just hope Mario doesn't meet up with three down or five down anytime soon. Gotta stay on the platform. Z. Probably a lot of them. Yep, there's another one right there. So, a whole bunch of these chompers to ensure that I try not to cheat. And no Yoshi, so... I don't think I've encountered Yoshi at all in this hack, so... I can't do that. I can't use him to walk on these chompers. Well, let's just keep going. Let's do as it says, stay on this platform. Or maybe as it's trying not to say, since it's one down, it wants to hinder Mario, so... Maybe it's saying, do not ride on the platforms. And maybe the one down is supposed to be the reward. But of course, Mario's smarter than that. Well, down here, apparently in the water, and looks like the end. Let's get out. Let's get in, actually. Back into this water. Mm, blooper. I'm suspicious that I cannot get rid of you with a cape. I probably can't. So I'll just try to avoid you. Hmm. And how low do you go? Probably low enough that you can hurt me. Lower than Super Mario Brothers 1 blooper. Oh! Question mark locks. One of them has a mushroom. Let's pick it up. Good. Hmm. Coins right here. Let's not go too low. Let's go up now and pipe. Quickly, Mario, get in. Good. Or get out. And back to this. Another 26. Congratulations, Mario. All right, so this should unlock another path to the Star World, the third one. Okay, but first I'm gonna go to Lakitu's castle. Actually, first I'm gonna get all four switch blocks before I go into the Star World. And now into the castle. So what will we have here? Hmm, green spikes, red spikes, hmm. This Lakitu must like those colors. Both of them. Maybe wants to try and make Mario and Luigi feel comfortable before the impaling death. Or whatever death it might be. Doesn't necessarily have to be impaling, it could be scalding. Could be anything that La Lakitu likes to laugh at. Well, this Lakitu. Of course, not all Lakitus are bad. Thank you, Super Mario 64, for clearing that up. Hmm, gotta go up there. Let's press it here. Alright. Now in we go. All the way to the other side. Blue blocks. Hmm. Gotta get rid of the spinies. And there's the key. In we go. 
Now what are we going to have? Nope. We're not going to have a falling ceiling. We're going to have some of these rotating discs. Again, roto discs. And some more thwomps. Hmm. That's a sideways one right there. Didn't know whether it was going to fall or go sideways. And I ducked just in time. Hmm. Well, ducking won't help me clear that one roto disc. Or this one either. But, th but staying in the middle will help me clear it. And that one's not even on a block. Now let's just try to avoid these runaway discs. At least that one's not a runaway. And now, up here. Ah, sideways thwomp. When you're off screen, you're sometimes it's gonna be really, really annoying. Hmm. Okay, a mushroom inside this. And good thing I didn't knock it out. Knock it away. Hmm. Let's put it right here. P-switch, okay. For this Yoshi coin, I guess. Yeah, that's probably gonna be it. Of course, there's one more Yoshi coin somewhere, I just don't know where it's gonna be. Oh, another sideways thwomp. And a fire flower. Eh, you could have fallen on me if time hadn't run out. But I have to do the work myself. Oh, and now... So, hmm, is it going to be a Yoshi's Island style Lakitu, or is it just going to be the Lakitu boss that I'm used to? Only got Super Mario Brothers 1 style spiny. Nope, it's going to be the Lakitu that I know about. And it throws Koopas and flames at me. And spinies too. Okay. Ouch. Okay, this doesn't seem like one that I'm going to have to save state, but it is going to be hard. Let's try this again, but this time, we will not shoot out the Koopa when it appears. We will instead throw it at the Lakitu. I said throw it at the Lakitu. And yeah, we could do it with the Goomba as well, but we cannot do it with the Spiny. Okay, that's one hit. Make Lakitu sad. Er. Hmm. Hopefully not scroll him off screen. Hopefully not glitch him out. Hmm. Okay, he's taken three hits so far, and the cape proves to be kind of useful here. Whenever there are flames, you can just knock them out. Whenever there are spinies, you can also just knock them out. Just don't let them hit you directly. Just don't let them go directly above you. Okay, uh, four hits so far. And just carry him over here. More than five hits. Um, hopefully it's six, but I kind of doubt it. And since there's a time limit, I'm not very com- Okay, it's six. <sighs> yeah, I was kind of worried about the time limit. Imagine how long this would take without a cape. Imagine how little time you'd have left. Well, get a fourth Yoshi egg, blow up another castle, or better yet, launch it into the air and give another mountain a headache. Ouch. Mario defeated the Lakitu boss in Castle 4. Mario is going to the forest. Watch for more danger and harder levels. The next area is World 5. Well, let's get a move on. Alright. So down we go, and next time we will take on another Geno's Forest, or World 5-1.